What's up guys? It has been a minute. It's actually been like two weeks, I think. Sorry, but I'm back and I'm excited. I figured that first we could just talk, catch up. School finally finished. I am so excited to finally be done with classes. That is the main reason why I have not been posting. I just wanted to get all of my stuff done then be able to focus on this i am actually taking a summer course as well it is the only class that i'm taking it is the only course that i'm taking so we're gonna get through it i made myself this schedule for the next three weeks that I'm going to use to keep myself in line. I've also been playing a fuck ton of Animal Crossing. That game is my life. And I, I just, it's, it's literally all I do at this point. It's that or watching TV or making schedules that I'm going to have a lot of trouble following. Summer is also coming up so freaking fast. Actually, it basically already is summer, I think. Now, I think it's like, I don't know if it like is a certain day, May or June. I think it's in June, but like whatever, it's basically summer. This summer, as we all know, it's a little bit different. Can't really go anywhere. Things are kind of really tough for everyone. A lot of people are going through hard time so you know everybody's staying home and there is no summer vacations really happening this year so i've been kind of reminiscing on the summer vacations that i have been lucky enough to have taken with my parents throughout my life my dad on family vacations is basically a dad i really don't know how else to describe him he's just a dad one thing that my dad likes to make me do is take a photograph of myself in front of literally anything that has my name in it. Whether it be a cafe, or a street, or a restaurant. Hey dad, why is it so important for me to take pictures in front of things when we're on vacation? Well, so that people know that uh, the picture was taken while you're on vacation. You could just go to a uh, magazine and see pictures of uh, the Taj Mahal, but uh, if you're not in the picture, then it's, it's no one's going to know you were there. You're not going to know you are there. It's going to be a lot less interesting. Ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> <laughs> Anything that has my name in it, it's like, Oh my gosh. You have to stand in front of it. Oh, come on. It'll be so good. Come on, come on, come on. Just go stand in front of it. I'll take a picture. Come on, it'll take two seconds. Okay. Is it good? Just stay right there. Perfect. Did you take it? These are amazing. Dad, people are watching. This is so embarrassing. My dad always makes us wake up at the crack of dawn just so that we can get ready and enjoy the entirety of our day. Good morning, everybody. We've got a long day ahead of us. We've got a museum tour. We've even got a bus tour. It's going to take us all around the city. It's going to take about four hours, so we got to get up now so that we can have breakfast and go on our museum tour, have the bus tour, have dinner, and then get home for some snacks and see the bands play in the restaurant downstairs. Who's with me? Everybody up! Come on, everybody! No matter how late we're out the night before, 7, 8 a.m., we got shit planned. We gotta go. <laughs> My dad also likes to take a lot of detours. His favorite expression is, we're only ever gonna be here once. So, you gotta take advantage of everything that you see. But sometimes, it's just, it's a little excessive. It's like, do we have to go see that? Do 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 Whoa, guys, we just passed a tomato farm. Do you guys want to go check it out? Mike, it's just a tomato farm. I don't understand why any of us would want to go there. 
<laughs> oh, come on, Dad. Do we have to? Oh, man, guys. We're turning around. There's a tomato farm around here. Man, I have not seen a tomato farm since I was... I'm also forever surprised at the roads and conditions that my mom and I trust my dad to be driving under when we are in other places. I mean, like, there have been times where we're seriously driving along the side of a cliff thousands of feet up and it is a one lane road there are cars coming the other direction and you have to like know when to pull over like these insane like windy roads up mountains driving on the opposite side of the road we live in the united states so we drive on the right going to other places where we have to drive on the left side of the road it's like oh yeah like dad can do it like it's fine just dad's got it <laughs> Jesus, Mike. Relax, relax. I got this. I've done this so many times, Beth. So many times, guys. Don't worry. We're like an inch from the cliff. Hey, Dad, when's the last time that you drove on the opposite side of the road? The last time I drove on the opposite side of the road? I have to say 1984? But, uh, yeah, like I said, like, I've got, I've got the experience, so I'm fine. Dad, you're on the, you're literally on the wrong side. You're on the wrong side of the road. Cat, just hold on. Hold on, okay? Hold on. Finally, I am not allowed to get a souvenir unless it has the name of the place that we are visiting on it. Otherwise... It's not considered meaningful. I have a lot of bags, uh, those bags with cities on them. Chicago, 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 <laughs> So many. I've collected so many of them over the years. You uh, find something you like? Something to remember, you know, all of our adventures by? Um, yeah, I think so. I, you know, I found this. I think it's super cute, so, um... I think I'm ready. Are you serious? How, how is that souvenir going to help you to remember where we were? I don't know, I guess cause like I got it here, you know? Are you kidding me? That's the most ridiculous thing I've ever heard in my life. You can't get that. What about something like this? All of your friends at school would be so jealous if you used this as your backpack. Look, it says San Diego all over it. This is something that you can't get anywhere else. You cannot get this anywhere but San Diego. You are going to be the only kid that's been to San Diego. Come on. Um, yeah, yeah, you know what? Why not? I bet your mom would want one too. Alright, let's go get one for your mom and then we're going to get out of here. Okay, so that is it for today's video. Oh. Okay. So I hope you guys enjoyed. Oh, is this light too bright? Like, would I look? Oh no, that's not bad. That was so good. Can somebody please put me on Dancing with the Stars? I hope you guys enjoyed. Um, I love my dad, and like I said, it is an absolute privilege for me to be able to take these vacations with my family. Next week, I'm going to do my best to have another video out, and then I will probably be taking a one-week hi hi <laughs> hiatus. So that I can write my final paper for my summer course and then I will be coming back and I'm hoping to start a ASL series I haven't really figured out all the details of it yet but uh, I did learn ASL 
if you don't know what that is, American Sign Language, in college for the last few years and I would really like to continue it and so I figure I have this platform to be able to make videos and I thought it would be really fun to make a storyline where I will sign everything on the script and do voiceover for everybody who is hearing and doesn't understand American Sign Language and I'm super excited. I am not at all fluent. I expect that I will probably make a lot of mistakes, but I want to do it because I want to learn to be better at it. So it's going to be super fun and I'm super excited for the next few weeks because, you know, got lots of stuff coming. I hope you guys are doing well, staying healthy. School is almost over and school is over for most college students out there. Um, I don't know why I keep doing this. I've used my hands so much in this video and it makes me so uncomfortable. I'm gonna sit on them and this is probably gonna look even weirder. Thank you guys so much for watching. It has been so much fun and I can't wait to see you guys soon. All right, stay well. Mm -hmm. Laugh a lot, laugh as much as you can. No, just let's, I'm gonna end this, goodbye. <laughs>